What's up people of the internet, I'm the big boat here with yet another video. In this video we will be testing the Intel Celeron N2840 which is a CPU based on the silver mod architecture and part of the Bechrel family of power efficient processors. It has two cores with no hyper threading of course and it has a burst frequency of up to 2.58 GHz. The Celeron N2840 has the Intel HD graphics page rail as the integrated graphics, which have 4 unified shaders and a burst frequency of up to 792 MHz in the Celeron's case. It's also based on the same Ivy Bridge architecture as the Intel HD 4000 wheel enough. We also have 4 GB of RAM in single channel mode, as well as a 500GB hard drive for the operating system and also which the game that we will be playing today is installed. As for operating system we use using normal Windows 10 as mom also uses the PC. You can find the full description of the specs in the video description down below. The game that we will be benchmarking today is Warframe. Shout out to the guy who requested it. And even though it was quite a pain to try to get the game to work because of the CPU but also because of that hard drive, I still managed to get it to run as expected. More on that in the description. And I'm glad I got to get this game working properly because fun fact, Warframe was released on my freaking birthday. Talk about birthdays. Anyway, let's get straight to the point now. Also, I'm using the Memory Reduct app and yes, I'm running the game with the Classic Engine instead of the Enhanced one. I'm gonna make one very important note. In the game settings, please, for the love of God, please, if you also have the Intel HD Graphics Bay Trail or the Intel HD 4000 or the Intel HD Ivy Bridge, do not turn on the upscaling. The game will crash and you won't be able to even launch the game afterwards. Trust me, I found it out the hard way. Use normal resolution scaling instead. So yeah, let's go.
Thank <laughs> you. 